Hello everyone and today I will cover the Halloween update. To find it go over here and select the Halo map. When you load in you will get the option of two cars. The SUV and the new Shadow Express. When you are done putting the car together you can choose a weapon or use one you already have in your backpack. You can choose a costume to wear by clicking on here. When you leave the garage turn right at the end of the road. You will find houses along the way but it will be easier to just drive straight to the landmarks. The first landmark is located at 1,500 meters, and here you will fight the witch boss. You will have to go around to each of the houses until you find the witch behind one of the doors. Some houses will have people in them that will give you the new candy currency, and other houses will have mobs inside that will attack you. Make sure you have your weapons ready before fighting the witch. The first door I opened she was behind it so now let's see her attacks. To avoid the first attack, go inside the houses where only one spike will spawn. If you have the vampire dagger, you can use it here. But since I have a friend with me, I won't use it since I might kill him in the process. Use the dagger on the mobs and not the boss because I tried that and the dagger would not damage anything afterwards until it was stored in my backpack. After this attack use AK-47 to damage the boss. It doesn't matter what weapon you use since they all do the same damage on this map but the AK seems to be one of the best. Completed the boss fight. This does take time to complete, but you do get a weapon afterwards. I will cover these weapons in another video and show what they do in more detail. The next landmark is at 3,000 meters. When you get there make sure to get out of the car and equip a weapon as fast as you can. This is because you will start to take damage when outside of this house. The best weapon for here is the vampire dagger, but if you are with a group of people use something else. This can also be a good spot to farm candy for spins in the lobby. You have to fight three waves of zombies and you will get a 15 second break between each wave. Completed the first wave. This is the final wave and after this we will move on to the final hurdle on the map. You will find the final landmark at 5000 meters. 
The tunnel will be closed off, and you have to go up this rough track where you will find the Headless Horseman. You will find all the mobs up here in cages along with King K. I think it is easier to walk up here. After you defeat this boss you can go through the tunnel, but there is only houses after this point where you can get extra candy. Since no one is with me here I will use the vampire dagger. The first attack is easy to avoid just step out of the area of the boss fight. Next attack run around avoiding these pink circles. With the dagger fighting these mobs is much easier. Now use the AK to damage the boss after these attacks. Nearly done just have to survive this attack. After each landmark you will unlock an achievement. After this fight you unlock the Shadow Express and the Pumpkin RPG. This weapon can be a good way to get food. If you go this way, you will find a mansion on top of the hill. You can't get inside, but there is a secret up here. I hope you found this video helpful and thank you for watching.